So with these challenges, where do we go from there? We, you know, we want to build a solution that's composable. We want to get those benefits. We want to mitigate or, or not have these challenges as much as possible. How do we do that? So let's talk about some strategies to mitigate those, um, those challenges. Yeah, and this is, this is the idea of standardization. Um, and I think that's probably the, the one that's moving the quickest, um, but also evolving the most um, over time. So we've seen, uh, first of all, one of the major pieces of standardization that we've seen is just like the data format is almost all JSON. So like JSON is like a low level data format that's being used almost universally between systems. So it's easier to work with. That's so that's one thing that's already happened. That was great. And that was a big point that was like a few years in the making, but also the idea of all the APIs being essentially what's called REST APIs and well-defined REST APIs using like a fairly well-defined standard. And um, it's either REST APIs or GraphQL, which is also another fairly well, <coughs> well understood standards. So just those are very low level protocols that that are in place. On top of that, now we're starting to see segments of, of the systems kind of work together well. CMS being one of those, head of the CMS being one of the segments, commerce, search. So we're, we're able to kind of put things in buckets so we can say, oh, this is this kind of system. Um, again, within those, uh, just as we saw with Aaron, how that works together within those systems is still, you know, kind of up for uh, up for archit architecting and getting doing that correctly, but the standardization is really how these systems talk to each other. Um, a lot of the APIs and data formats are already fairly standardized, so now we're at the what I would say is the connector level, um, and even getting towards more of the accelerator level, where as I was sort of hinting at before. Um, a lot of system integrators are starting to do this now, where they're putting together, oh, here's our package of you know, headless CMS search and commerce or whatever for different kinds of solutions um, to kind of pitch to folks to say, hey, do, does your problem look like this? Here's a way that you can solve that kind of potential business problem with this, these kind of things that are already standardized to work together in a well-defined way. Um, starting to see a lot more things like that, where those interfaces and protocols between the systems have already been figured out. We know they work together really well to solve a certain kind of vertical business problem. Yeah, one, one thing I'll add on here too is just building standards within your organization of how you decide you want to roll something out as well. So <laughs> if you're working with a system integrator or you have your own development team, have you guys sat down and said, you know what, if we have these specific ways we want to solve something, we always do it this way. We do it this way in the CMS. We do it this way in the e-commerce. We do it this way in the marketing automation platform. And that could be around calling APIs between systems or tying things together, and what is that standardization that's consistent? Um, even like naming things, as Joel just wrote into the to the window there. You know, like make sure you have that standardization because it'll make it way way easier to swap things out because you could follow the standardization standardization or just to read and understand what you've done. 